हेलो एवरी वन आई एम अरिना इंटरनेशनल मास्टर एंड फीडे इंस्ट्रक्टर ऋषिकेश चौहान वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल लेट स्टार्ट टू डेज प्रैक्टिस गेम सो वी आर टेकिंग फाइव प्लस थ्री टाइम कंट्रोल एज यूजल Let's continue with sniper. Mm, what should we do? Let's see. Let's try pushing the pawn. Of course, we will go. We will play this. We should have moved the bishop back. There was no need to do that. Let's sacrifice the pawn. Okay, develop the pieces first. First thing first, we have sacrificed a pawn to open some lines. So I hope this pawn will uh, give us some advantage. So we are stopping our opponent from playing this or developing the bishop. Okay. Okay, let's play this. I'm not sure whether this will work or not. My plan is to play knight b6. Next in this bishop. This bishop is holding a lot of important squares. So once that bishop falls, we'll target these squares. And knight b6 any which way looks uh, very nice. We won't capture this pawn right away because once this uh, pawn is gone, our uh, weakness, this backward pawn will be exposed. Okay, he's more worried about the pawn, which is good for us. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. I was about to blunder a rook to, uh, right now. Here we'll simply capture the rook because if we capture, boom. Let's continue capturing the pawn first. First thing first. So this is our new target. Then we will try playing something like this, getting the knight ahead. He may push the pawn uh, to stop. Uh, okay, that will also do. This works right. And his rook is gone. Forced Rook into Rook, max to max he can give this check, we will play bishop f8 and no bishop f6 is possible, first of all pawn is there and then second thing this bishop is pinned. He should move the bishop uh, away. So we'll capture uh, on b1 and then we'll capture the pawn. If you move the bishop away, that uh, will be a better option for us. Well, I don't want this check coming up. Right now, it, it seems nothing is happening, but still. What is he calculating? There is nothing much left, right? He has to take a call whether to sacrifice a rook uh, for a knight uh, or for a bishop or for a rook. For rook means he is losing an exchange. But whether to let uh, black capture this or this. Okay, we are happy. As long as this rook is over here, nothing is happening. Even if you place this, we can simply block. We won't even block, maybe we can simply attack this thing, right? Play this. I don't mind sacrificing the bishop, not sacrificing, giving, giving up the sniper bishop for that knight because after this capture, his bishop will remain blocked.
it's better to exchange right here yeah. when you have one full rook it's better to exchange the pieces He has to play bishop e3 forced or king h2 can also be played oh and we won uh, i don't think there is anything uh, much left for white in this position uh, he lost on time but his position is already difficult uh, he should have played something like bishop e3 and then it will be difficult for black to uh, get this knight out but then here i was thinking uh, about playing this first uh, then bishop into bishop pawn into bishop and then we can sorry then we can get the knight out but we should uh, keep an eye on this uh, pawn as well as the uh, white rook is already on the seventh rank uh, but having a one extra rook is a huge ad advantage and i don't think uh, Losing couple of pawns for that advantage is a big thing, but our opponent uh, choked up on time and uh, we won a nice game. I hope you enjoyed this uh, game. Thank you very much, everyone.